What's going on, people? Uh, today I've actually got a brand new install uh, that just uh, we actually just finished doing it. It is the UCCX100T. Uh, so I'm actually going to take you over to the conference room right now. And I'm going to show you how we have everything uh, all, hook, all hooked up, and I'm also going to tell you about one quick uh, limitation uh, that I have found uh, with it. So let's uh, go over the components and see how it's hooked up. Here is our uh, conference room. Um, you can see we've got a dual display. Uh, we've got a, a PTZ camera uh, underneath the TVs. Uh, we've got some Crestron uh, speakers. We have a uh, Shure MXA 910. Uh, we've got some more speakers here. And then in the back here, we have our 1070, which is our touch panel, which is control for the room. And then we have our rack. We got the, uh, the DMPS 34K 350C. Uh, and then, of course, here is the uh, the CX100, which everybody is uh, anxious to uh, see. And, of course, we've got a BIAMP, uh, and we've got an uh, XPA201. Underneath the table, we've got a couple devices. We have the uh, – this is actually new uh, with this particular setup. This is the UCPR. Uh, this is the uh, presentation transmitter. And then, of course, we have just our standard uh, DMTX202 uh, 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 right here. Looking at the back of the EC, uh, we have internet uh, coming in here. Uh, we have this is going to one of our uh, monitors, and this is going to our other monitor, and this is USB. Here we have the Crestron HD converter USB 260, uh, and this basically has our camera input and output and our content input and output, uh, and then it is a USB out of this directly into uh, the UC. Uh, and this is also connected to the transmitter uh, underneath the table. So right here on the back of the 260, uh, you can see right here where it says uh, RXN, uh, this cable right here. Uh, we've got runs directly over to the table. Let me show you where it connects. And we're back underneath the table looking at the uh, UCPR. And you can see here that says uh, 2RX. So that is on the back of this. Uh, we also have a uh, LAN port uh, on this. And if you flip it around to the other side, uh, you can see this cable. This is actually where we plug the uh, touch panel, the 1070 in, which is uh, sitting up on top of the, uh, the table. And then these two ports right here, this is the USB uh, and the HDMI in, and this is for uh, the bring your own device portion of uh, this. So these, this HDMI and this USB uh, go directly up to the top of the table. And the cables come up here, uh, and you can see, and I've got them plugged into, I've got an HP and a Macintosh. In order to use the bring your own device portion, here is the HDMI uh, from down below the table, and here is the USB. Uh, so this is actually USB-C, so I'm just going to plug this directly into my computer. And one thing you got to do pretty quick is this here, you have to make sure you select host a meeting from your computer. And then once you do that, you can then select your audio uh, and video devices. Uh, if you don't press that button on here, uh, you'll be able to select your audio devices, your audio, your audio out devices. Uh, but you won't be able to divide, you won't be able to set your audio in and your camera. Now let's go over to the Macintosh, and the Macintosh works the exact same way. As soon as I unplug the USB C, you can see this then goes back to the regular interface. So now I'm going to plug this into my Mac. Ugh. And same thing, I have to select host meeting from your computer. And then everything works the exact same way. I can go down here to my uh, custom device setups. I can go to device settings. Uh, and then you can see up here, you know, I have my, I can do a custom setup. And then speakers, I have my Crestron selected. Uh, and my microphone, I have the correct microphone. I can select the MacBook or I can select uh, the UT audio. Uh, and then down below, I have the camera and that's the camera in the room and I can switch back and forth between uh, my internal camera right here or my PTZ camera in the room, uh, which is up there. And then again, as soon as I unplug my USB-C, this goes back to the regular uh, Teams interface. 
if you don't have the USB-C and you just have a standard USB cable, you have to plug the USB cable in and you have to plug the HDMI. But since we have the, since we've got the USB-C uh, in this particular room, uh, you do not need to use the uh, the HDMI cable because uh, video and audio both go through uh, USB-C. I know this is a super quick uh, video, just a quick tour of how everything was uh, was hooked up. If you guys have any questions at all, uh, please leave them in the comment section below. Um, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. If this is your first time to the channel. Please subscribe. Have yourself a great day.